dance. So, today let's go see Mabel Juan in her studio. The blue one. Whee! Let's go! Hello! Hi! Hello, Naplat. It's very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Mabel Juan. Thank you for the interview. Thank you for visiting my studio. You're welcome. What a nice blue room. Can you begin by telling us how you define your practice? I'm a musician and I play the piano. I also play other keyboard instruments. How long have you been doing this? I started playing the piano when I was eight years old. And ever since then, I've been really interested in new and old music and sound and noises and how to perform these invisible things. So interesting. And what inspires you to create? I'm inspired by the people around me. I love hearing what they have to say, how they say things, what their voices sound like, how they look when they walk down the street. I'm inspired by movement and patterns and colors and shapes. I also get a lot of inspiration from visual art like sculpture. And I also get inspiration from writing and reading. Wow! That's a lot of inspiration. I love it. I can move on. Let's put on some of your music. Can you tell me about what you're working on now? I'm working on a lot of chamber music right now, and I'm also working on a concert that will be outside. Cool, cool. Just please look out the window. Okay, Celia, what is chamber music? Cheese snippets. Hmm, I didn't find anything on the web for that. Ah! Okay, Celia. What is chamber music? Here is some information. Chamber music is a form of classical music that is composed for a small group of instruments, traditionally a group that could fit in a palace chamber or a large room. By convention, it usually does not include solo instrument performances. Because of its intimate nature, chamber music has been described as the music of friends. Oh, wait. Chamber music. What is your favorite part about your process? My favorite part of being an artist and a musician is the part where I'm still trying to figure out what I'm doing. I like trying to figure out new sounds and new projects that I don't have the answer to yet because um, it's really fun. It's like trying to solve a mystery and you have to brainstorm new ideas and then you have to try them out and sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't and it's very exciting. to collaborate, it is the best part of being a musician and artist in my opinion. I usually play with other musicians. We play chamber music together or we improvise. And I've also worked with dancers, actors, writers, and visual artists. It's very fun. Oh, wow. And tell me why it is important to make music and out. I think it's really important to make new things, to make artwork. I think everyone has the ability to do that. And I think when we do that, we realize that um, many things are possible. We can dream big ideas and try them out. 
And I think it helps other people to see us doing that, to see you doing that. And I think when people try to make things to help others, it just makes everything better for everyone. Where can we find more of your work? If you come to Chicago, you can hear me play. Um, otherwise, you can find some of my recordings and videos online. That's the end of the show. Oh, I'm so sad to leave the fabulous blue room. Bye, Mabel. Thanks. Signing off. Bye. <laughs>